Hi guys, this is Marquisha and I am here to share with you guys another project for Saturday Morning Challenge of Friends. This challenge is hosted by Shantae and Joyce and um, I will be participating again as well as Felicia and I will put a link down in the description box so you can go over and check out these ladies fabulous projects. I know that you will not be disappointed. So our project this week was to use our Prima dolls and you could use them however you wanted to use them. And of course I have not really pulled out my dolls um, since I first purchased them. And the one that I decided to use was this one here and I can't remember her name but you know she's the one with the little dress here um, looks like she's number one on the Prima Dolls and I don't have all of them but um, again I you know got a few I got on the bandwagon with everyone else and I did purchase some so I was really um, you know glad that I was able to pull those out and actually to work a project with them besides them you know up for storage so let me just show you some of the prod products that I use for this project I use this um, apple bloom paper here by Tilda very pretty shabby chic paper I also use this Sizzit um, die here and I use the love um, word word there I use this Prima stencil here and it's the one with the raindrops on it. So I used that and kind of did a little mixed media. And then I um, also added some kind of a pocket letter to my project. And so I used the Tim Holtz um, eight pocket um, little pouches here for it. And it's really small, just something that you can use to um, add to your project. So let me go ahead and show you guys. Um, what I created and I also use the Tilda um, all that spring paper as well and so um, here is my doll here and I colored her with my Copics I added some little pearls for earrings there and then I paper pieced her dress there and then I added this um, metal rose embellishment to her center there and I just recently got that from Becky Colvin here on YouTube I believe and um, this little sentiment here says look at her sparkle and of course you can see all of the sparkle on this um, envelope here and um, I just did some layering of some flowers here I used some of the um, die cuts from the paper and just you know put those there on the paper I used a Martha Stewart punch and punched out these little butterflies here and added some um, pearls in the center there. I just added a doily and on this tag that I created, this is where I did the mixed media. So I just used some um, some paste and um, you know just kind of added a little mixed media and then just you know added my uh, sparkle to that as well. This is a Project Life piece or an ephemera piece um, I got in, I think, the Jack and Jill um, pack. And I put that at the top and I added some seam binding. And this here, the story goes along with this envelope that I created um, for my pocket letter. I just added some of this really gorgeous trim from Hobby Lobby. I really like that trim there. Added some lace at the bottom. And this is where I used the die cut from the Sizzix die and just cut it out and then added a doily there and some trim. So that's how the envelope um, came out. And I created this envelope with my um, We Are Memory Keepers envelope punch and just created a really large envelope. Now I, I must say that I got the idea of using the um, pocket letter um, envelope from Bona here live love scrap on YouTube she has a video um, where she did a um, envelope for a pocket letter so that's where I got the idea to actually come up with this here so let's just turn it over and again I just simply you know made an envelope and then I created a really really small pocket letter and again I used the tilde paper there I added some really pretty trim and this of course is one of my favorite trims. 
I added these metal embellishments here just to kind of give a little bit added touch to my um, little mini pocket letter. I have some die cuts here uh, from the Tilda paper. And then this sentiment says, I always believe that something wonderful is about to happen. And the top part here is that she believed she could, so she did. And then I just added a little pearl there. I had some sequins here that I added, and I just sealed it with some trim at the top. And I added some of this really pretty um, kind of tan and gold um, ribbon there in this little pocket there. And so the back, I just simply, uh, again, added some embellishments. I have a tag and some flowers here and just some trim. And then um, this is a Project Life card where I will journal uh, when I decide to um, send this out to someone. And then I will put my message there. And so it's really, really, you know, fun, just a little mini. You know, if you don't want to really do a full-size pocket letter, you can uh, most definitely use a little small one and I had those and I thought that you know why not try to use them and so it just slides right back into you know the envelope here and you just close it up however you want to close it up and there is my um, project so thanks guys so much for watching um, please leave a comment below and don't forget to go over and check out the other ladies videos and I will talk to you guys in my next video bye